we're so excited kasi we're going to Gyeongbuk Gong Palace and magsusood kami ng hanbok. Yun yung traditional clothes nila. So, we walk from our hotel 30 to 35 minutes just to reach the Gyeongbok Gong Palace. So, sabi nila, the Gyeongbok Gong Palace is the largest palace built during the Joseon Dynasty. Entrance fee for Gyeongbok Gong Palace is about 3,000 won. But if you are wearing hanbok, it would be for free. So, nag-rent kami ng hanbok, which is around 900 pesos each. So, nag turn to turn kami. We're all in deep red. Tapos, yun na, free na yung entrance sa uh, Gyeongbok Gong Palace. So, at around 10 a.m., changing of guards will happen. And also, at around 2 in the afternoon. So, you must be there at around 10 or around 2 para makita nyo yung ceremony. And also, they are closed during Tuesdays. And they are open from 9 in the morning to 6.30 in the afternoon, in the evening. Uh, maraming mga nakahanbok. So, just seeing them or watching them, nakakaalim na. Pagpasok mo dun sa palace is uh, napakalaking ground. So, ang daming building. So, makikita mo uh, yung architectural design ng bahay ng Koreans or ng palace. Um, hindi ka pwede pumasok sa mga building but you can see it from the outside na open na may mga bintana pero uh, tourists are restricted to enter the only building na pwedeng pasukin na napasok namin is the library which is of course you have to change to remove your shoes before entering the the building the usual tradition nila and also napakalaki ng palace ground uh, parang hindi namin matatapos for half day so we stayed there for at least more than 2 hours yata pero everything is instagramable picture perfect so mag enjoy kayo lalo na if you are wearing handbook um, you will be like a princess or prince or a king kapag ka naka handbook na kayo and uh, Ang cute tingnan, maski mga iba pag nasasalubong nyo. And also, pag naka-handbook ka, uh, pati headdress, bags, accessories, kasama na rin dun sa fee na binayaran. And also, there is no restaurant inside the palace ground, no refreshment, no convenience store at all. And if you're hungry and if you are thirsty, you have to go out of the palace and if you want to go back, pwede naman. But, nakakapagod sa sobrang laki. And, uh, kasi, inabot kami ng 12 noon. So, masyado ng mainit. Considering na layer-layer yung damit namin. Kasi, nakahanbo. And, um, um, just uh, a few more walk. Nandun na kayo sa hand. Hanok Village, so we decided to cross the street and walk for 15 minutes wearing our handbook going to the Hanok Village. So the Hanok Village doon, meron restrictions sila, very particular sila na huwag masyadong maingay sa village kasi marami pang resident ang nakatira doon. And then sa Hanok Village, meron ding handbook rental, parang mas cheaper doon. And, uh, wala namang binabayaran sa village kasi it's just a village na na-preserve yung design ng mga bahay and architectural design. Parang, kung ikukompare mo sa Philippines is siya yung Crisologo Street ng Vigan. And then, uh, sa Hanok Village, um, meron ng mga restaurants. Doon na kami nag-lunch. So, Meron ng restaurants, maraming pagpipili ang cafe, they have souvenir shops, and then also there are art galleries, and then a few more walk in sa dong na, so you can have your souvenir, souvenir doon, uh, you can shop for souvenir, you can uh, enter the little mini museums for free, and then also pwede, merong shopping area ng garments, 
meron ding uh, cafes, coffee shops, and meron ding mga convenience store. So, that's it for the palace and for the Hanok experience and the wearing of handbook. So, I'll see you in Hongdae. So, welcome to Hongdae. We visited in Hongdae the Chik Ai Museum, which is which has three parts, the Ice Museum, the 3D, and also the VR. So, first, we tried the Ice Museum. So, it was not cold in the Ice Museum. It was freezing cold. Our outfit was not suitable for the museum. So, uh, we stayed there only for about... Um, 10 minutes though we tried the slide made of ice and also there are uh, cartoon characters sculpted in ice and also there was an igloo there where where you can enter and spend a, mi a few minutes inside and also there's this um, uh, toilet or comfort room up from ice and uh, also there is this um, animals sculpt in ice so we did not stay there for long it was so cold it's so it is freezing inside and next is the 3d so we entered at the 3d or illusion uh, museum there we stayed there for less than two hours and daming makikita and daming pwedeng pagpicturan in different styles, in different effects. Also, don't forget to download their mobile app, the Augmented Reality Mobile app, so for additional effects. And yes, recommended for kids, for adults, for lolos and lolas. Pwede yung, uh, yung area na ito. And uh, it was fun inside. So, thumbs up ako dito sa 3D. And then, our mm, hindi masyadong enjoyable. Siguro sa mga kids, pwede. But, for 675 pesos, yes, it's worth it. It's worth to visit. It's worth the money. So, all in all, enjoy pa rin. So, that's it guys for home day for the Trick Eye Museum. And then, outside the states of Mohongdae, of course, there are skincare products all over and also shopping for garments and also souvenir shops. Of course, the Harry Potter Cafe also. And also, uh, I've noticed that mas mahal ang food sa Hongdae compared to Myeongdong. Uh, also, the street foods available in Hongdae, the same as sa Myeongdong. But, Hongdae is for the young ones. There are artists doing mini concert just in the streets of Hongdae. And, uh, there are magic shows in the street of Hongdae. There are puppet shows in the street of Hongdae for free especially during weekends our channel today we're going to tour you in everland we book our everland tour by a club for about 1500 pesos each person a shuttle bus a shuttle bus took us a shuttle bus met us a shuttle bus met took us to everland we showed our QR code at the entrance of Everland and we were greeted by the Magical Tree. Everland is the only theme park with a zoo called Zootopia. If you want to experience safari, go straight to Zootopia. If you are with your kids, Magic Land is perfect for them for less extreme rides. But if you are looking for adventure and adrenaline rush, adrenaline rush, try the T-Express. It is a wooden roller coaster 
which is the steepest in the world. Feeling romantic? Try the Rose Garden for some romantic moments. Stay up to 8 p.m. and you will have the chance to watch their Moonlight Parade. Moonlight Parade is a unique one because this is a parade of blinking LED lights in different colors, shapes, and designs. Watch for the amazing fireworks. Bringing of foods inside Everland is allowed and you can have a picnic there while you are on queue. Everland is the happiest place in Korea and we will be back there by winter there to try the ski. See you there! We took a train going to Gangnam. So in Gangnam, uh, we visited the Starfield Library. So we arrived there at, uh, at 12. It's so huge. Ang ganda niya. Kaya lang, wala kaming makitang English book. But all in all, ang ganda-ganda ng library nila. The library is inside actually a, a, a mall. And then, we had our lunch in the mall. So, sa Starfield Mall or Coex Mall. Coex Mall. And then, uh, mura ang food. Masarap. And, ang ganda. Yung kanilang uh, food court. Ang ganda. Ang ayos-ayos. And one more thing. I've noticed na ang mga Koreans sa food court, iniiwan lang nila cellphone sila sa ibabaw ng table nila just to reserve the table. Ang galing. Uh, after namin mag-lunch, we went to the Coex Aquarium. So, the Coex Aquarium, we booked it via crew parang 900 pesos each person. So, the Coex Aquarium is so huge. Ang ganda. Ang daming species. Ang daming pwedeng matutunan. Okay for the kids, uh, the old ones also. There are also shows inside the Coex. Uh, there was this mermaid show na napanood namin. And yung isa dolphin show or sea lion show meron pa rin. Marami kung ano-anong <coughs> show na mapapanood. Time that all you need is... Uh, <coughs> And also, uh, is uh, merong side na pang bata. So, if you have kids, toddlers, meron silang pwedeng pag -istayan. And also, inside the Coex Aquarium, meron silang libreng uh, photoshoot wearing handbook. So, you can wear a handbook. Tapos, may corner doon na pwede kayong mag-photoshoot. So, if you don't have a chance to wear a handbook in the palace, you can wear it doon sa Coex Aquarium for free. And, um, there's this uh, underground shopping and also yung mall nila, maganda. Also, the Pormas. Uh, for Gangnam, nagupos yung oras namin doon sa aquarium. Ang ganda kasi. And doon sa library, we went back ng night time naman. This is it, guys! O, oh, ayan. This is mushroom stew with mushroom sauce and then uh, uh, uh. I think I Jansel Spam Ang tawag din anak Spam and sausage Spam and sausage too and this one is bulldog okay. We were surprised na nakita namin na dumating meron siyang mga side dishes na ganyan Ito is tofu This is sweet potato and this is um, pistachio, and then this is ketchup, and may pa kimchi pa, may pa rice pa, water, and super sarap. Lahat ng restaurants dito, ang tinda ni Sanjupsal. May hirap maghanap ng ibang restaurant. May init pa rin ang food ko. Yeah, bye! Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give us a thumbs up, click the bell button, and subscribe to our channel. If you have any question, please write it down below and I will get back to you. 
This is Bumblebee and see you in our next video. Ciao!